there was a lot of attention that we took a very strong stance about buying our right to buy oil from Russia. If we take today a strong position on terrorism, we take a strong position because we are big victims of terrorism. We will have no credibility. If we say, you know, when terrorism affects us, it is very serious, but when it happens to somebody else, you know, that is not so serious. I'll give you the example of Ukraine. I know it's a lot of attention that we took a very strong stance about buying our right to buy oil from Russia. I want you to think, agar us samay hum log jhuk jate, agar wo option humne exercise nahi kiya hota, what difference would it have made to you? Think how much higher your petroleum price would have been. Think how much inflation would have gone up in this country. So, it, it is not ये, ये, it, it is not just a matter of pride or I would say statement of independence. It is also today a good government, a strong government stands up for its people. Stands up for its people like good governance is necessary at home. Right judgments is necessary abroad. That if we take today a strong position on terrorism, we take a strong position because we are big victims of terrorism. We will have no credibility. If we say, you know, when terrorism affects us, it is very serious, but when it happens to somebody else, you know, that is not so serious. We have to have a consistent position. Similarly, when we, every other country looks after the welfare of its people, its economic interests. The same countries in Europe who are saying don't buy oil from Russia, वो खुद ले रहे थे और खुद उन्होंने अपना एक ऐसा schedule बनाया ताकि the impact on their population was less. So how do you have a government which stands up for what uh, is uh, necessary, uh, what is in the interest of its people? And I can tell you, there, there will be pressures on us because that is the nature of the world. And a strong government, a, a strong government and a good government are two sides of the same coin.